But first at six, Shelby Township State Senator Peter Lacido is facing the fallout of sexual harassment allegations. Good evening to you. I'm Carolyn Clifford. And I'm Dave Llewellyn. Thank you for joining us. The investigation is over tonight, and 7 Action News reporter Simon Shaket tells us the conclusion has consequences. Inappropriate workplace behavior. That's how the Michigan Senate Majority Leader is referring to conduct by Republican State Senator Peter Lacido, following what he calls a thorough and exhaustive investigation. Lacido is also being removed from chairing the Michigan Senate Advice and Consent Committee and being made to undergo more training after allegations surfaced that he made inappropriate comments towards State Senator Mallory McMorrow, as well as a female news reporter in front of a group of high school boys. According to records just released, an investigation involving more than 30 interviews found accusers' claims of sexist comments by Senator Lacido to be, quote, credible. The Michigan Senate says since receiving their findings on March 2nd, they've repeatedly acknowledged their intent to be transparent by releasing those findings publicly. Furthermore, findings of that report say Lacido's conduct, quote, demonstrates an unfortunate pattern of behavior that requires little to no interpretation to be understood as inappropriate workplace behavior. The Senate now plans to announce a bipartisan work group in the next few weeks to review current policies and make suggestions for improvement. Today, the office of Senate Majority Leader Mike Shirky declining to do an interview with us, instead referring us to their statement. We've also reached out to Senator Lacido, who represents the 8th District including Mount Clemens, Shelby Township, and St. Clair Shores. But so far, he's not responded to a request for comment. From Macomb County, Simon Shaykat, 7 Action News. All right, thank you so much, Simon.